Hey everybody, this is Coach Austin again with back at you guys with some core exercises. Um, all these exercises should be completed in a sequence, so that means that you should do them without stopping. Uh, this should be a fairly difficult exercise for you guys, but I know you can do it. So, all levels should be doing these in three sets. So you should have three separate sets of these core exercises. So the first exercise on the list is uh, 16, 16, and 12 reps of crunches. So what you're going to do, you lay on your back, you lift your knees this high, and then you just, you just hold your hands on your ears. Do not pull on the back of your head, and you're going to do 16 reps of crunches. Just like that, just bringing your upper body to your knees. Then the next exercise we have is eight, eight, and six cross crunches on each side. So that means you have to do one for each. So you extend one leg, you touch your arm, elbow to your knee on this side, and you just switch. So one, two, two, three, three. And now the exercise, exercise I have on the list is V-ups. I have 16, 16, and 12 reps of V-ups. What you're gonna do, you lift your upper body with your, your legs at the same time. Reach all the way to your toes and come back down just like that. You must do the full arm movement. You can't just touch your toes like this. That's not a V-up. The next exercise I have on the list right after the V-ups is the hollow rocks for 15 seconds each time. So you maintain your best hollow body position, no arch to lower backs, round the back to the floor, lift your arms up straight, and just rock here for 15 seconds. Then right after that, we have eight butterfly kicks each leg. So what you're going to do, you just raise your legs up and down in a hollow body position each set. One, two, three, four. Okay. Right after that, you're going to roll over to your stomach. You can do 16, 16, and 12 arch-ups. So what you're going to do, you just raise your arms and your legs at the same time. One, two. Three. These ones can be done either slow or fast. Right after that, I have arch swims. So basically, you're just going to crisscross your front, your, your opposite arms, and your opposite legs. So you just raise them up just like that, and you switch. I have these for 15 seconds. So you can do it while holding your arch position to make it even harder. Right after that, I have an arch rock for 15 seconds. Same thing, holding your arch, just rocking up and down. That's it guys. Um, I know this core exercise should be difficult, but I really think you guys should be able to do it. Make it a challenge, make it fun. Um, do anything it takes to get through.